Hey y'all, hope you're doing super well. If you're new to DaVinci Resolve 18 and you want to know how to turn your uh, a series of images into a time-lapse clip in DaVinci Resolve 18, this is how you do it. Okay, so creating a time-lapse clip from a sequence of images is super easy in DaVinci Resolve. Before we start and actually create a clip, just want to point out here this little gear at the bottom on the right corner of DaVinci. Uh, this, you just click this and this brings up your uh, project settings. Uh, you can set your resolution um, and also importantly your frame rate. So uh, when you create a time lapse, typically you have shot the images with a specific uh, interval in mind as far as uh, time frame. So the first thing you want to do when you when you create the clip is just to be mindful that you can set the frame rate that you want. Uh, using uh, this part of DaVinci. So all that you need to do in DaVinci Resolve 18 to create a time-lapse clip out of a sequence of images is to first make sure that you're in the Media tab. It's the first tab on the uh, left side of your um, menu down at the bottom here. Then you just basically need to scroll to the specific folder where you have the images. Now it's important to have the sequence of images that you want to use in a single folder by themselves, uh, numbered sequentially if possible. There are ways to deal with non-sequential, uh, sequentially numbered images. But in this video, I'm just going to talk about um, number images that are numbered sequentially. So make sure you have just one set of images in a folder because it auto detects. And if you don't do that, sometimes it doesn't work. So that's right, all you do is click on the folder that you want to use, then right click or control click on an iMac and just uh, click add into media pool. This adds the uh, sequence of images onto your timeline and now it is basically available for editing um, and doing whatever you want to do with the time lapse. Okay, and so if that's not working and the clips are staying uh, individual uh, or not automatically showing up as a, as a single file and they're all there still in their individual glory, uh, this is how you troop troubleshoot that problem right here. Okay, so you went through all of that and when you uh, went to the folder, so you went to the media tab, you found the folder with your sequence of images. Uh, you click on the folder and it shows all of the images individually. There is not a, DaVinci did not recognize it as a single uh, clip. Easy thing to address. Uh, you're still in the media tab down here. You click on these three dots right up here at the top of your menu, your screen or your uh, display. You go to uh, frame display mode and here it clicked auto so for some reason it didn't recognize it. Um, you, you then would hit sequence and that will automatically convert it into a sequence. Add it to your timeline by selecting add into media pool and you're right back and you're good to go. Okay, I hope you found that helpful. Please uh, subscribe to my channel and help me reach a thousand subscribers. That would be so awesome. Thanks and take care.